Hello, fellow potatoes. It's me, Munchmoy. And welcome to the Roxanne figure review. I almost said plush review. Um, so this is the Roxanne figure, but first... This is my figure, by the way. Yeah, not mine. First, we're going to review her instrument. So, basically, it's like a... It's like a keyboard. I think they're called keyboards, right? Uh, yeah, they're called keyboards. Okay, this is this is a keyboard. If I get it wrong, I'm very sorry. Um, if you look very closely, my camera would focus. Wait, let me just like focus it. Look, you get like tiny little indents. So if we just like focus it, focus, focus. Oh, it focused for a second. You're just like, hello. Okay, won't focus, but like, if you look closely. <laughs> if you look closely, you can see small little indents for like the keys. That's pretty cool. Um, <laughs> <laughs> that, was funny. that was funny. Um, so now we're gonna actually look at the actual figure. Um, so let's start with the head as usual. As you can see, the the paint on the lips is kind of chipping. Well, it's just like just focus. <laughs> Did you just say the macaroni hand? <laughs> um, what the heck? So as you can see, she has yellow hands. Yellow hands! You're confusing me! She has yellow eyes and it's just her her head is basically just like a reused uh mangle figure, okay, the fun time foxy figure. Um but that's okay because I think it kinda works with Roxanne. They forgot her paint on the side of her face, which is kind of annoying. But you know, you can always add that, it's not that hard. You just need a bit of sharpie. Um so you have earrings. If it would focus. Um, and then we have a purple earring. Um, so she has one purple earring and then one black earring. So if we look at the back, we can see that she has like really smooth hair. Like this reminds me of the one time when I was like five, I used to collect mushy monsters. Oh yeah, I collected um, them as well. Yeah, they were like crazy when I was like five. I, the, I had like a huge castle of them. I my, don't know why, but her favorite, hair reminds me of My favorite them. was the gingerbread one. Yeah, I had like a clear gingerbread one, but he all I still have him, I think. Oh. Um, he's, he has like a little bit of like plastic um, that sticks out, which isn't supposed to be there. It would always spike my finger, and I'd be I had depressed. this like house, and it was like a DJ sort of place. Yeah, it was really cool. Well, let's stop talking about mushy monsters and get yeah. on to the rest of the. We're people. not here so, for mushy monsters. We're here for for now. So let's snap off her arms and have a look. Let's look at her arms after. Um, so here we have her without her arms. This is what she looks like. Um, there is the back of her. It's kind of hard to see. But look, if you look closely, there's no detail on the back. It's just painted. Um, let's put her arms back on so then we can look at her arms. Okay, um, so I got her arms back on. So her arms are small, like Glamrock Chica's. Um, she has, like, these huge bracelets. They're, like, the size of, um... Size of a uh, uh, Rockstar Foxy's arm. So they're pretty big. And uh, she has like these small claws. If you look closely, if it would focus, um, focus, focus. Well, you can probably see from where you are right now that she has small little claws and they are quite pointy so they do kind of prick your finger. It's kind of like if you sharpen a pencil enough, that's what it kind of feels like, except it's a few of them and they're really small. So next we're gonna have a look at her tail. So here's her tail. It's kind of like in a wave pattern, like she's just wagging her tail. That's pretty cool. I like her top, like the, the red. Yeah, I like how shiny it is. Yeah. Um. 
I like like the black pattern on the top. Yeah, and it's also here. Um, on the Roxanne plush, they didn't add like the stripe pattern. Well, they did. Well, they added like the shiny. Yeah, but not the stripes. Yeah. They could have added the stripes. Yeah. I might do that to my Roxanne thing. Uh, not figure plush. Ooh. Or maybe not. I don't know. Okay. Um, but I like how she's wagging her tail. And now for the last part of Roxanne, her legs. Um, so her legs are pretty basic. They got like the tiger pattern and I like the claws. All the security breach I think have claws except Vanny. Um, so that's basically her, the whole of her legs. She doesn't have that much on her legs. Why would I rate this figure out of 10? I'd rate it 10 out of 10. I recommend buying probably the best security breach figure out of all of them. Um, definitely the most accurate. I mean, I'd probably, on the accuracy scale, I'd rate, like, probably an 8. Because they're still missing, like, a few details. Like, the stripes on the face. And, you know, like, basically it. Also, I like the fact that she kind of has, like, a collar. That's quite cool. Um, but basically, that's the whole figure. Would I recommend buying? Yes. Why does she always die?